Hey, can we sneak in? How are we supposed to do that? I have an idea to sneak oh, in. Oh, these kids are so dumb. Do they shouldn't do that. Don't go inside. It's a bad idea at night. Hey, let's find the switch. Yeah, uh, just a second. God, they're gonna die. Because we all know. There is light. Wow, this place is brand new. It is. Wow, it really does. Have they opened yet? Because I don't know which builder know. they have to decorate like open. this. Let's explore around the place. We might be the first ones to do it. I think this is a bad idea, and what if we get in trouble? Oh, definitely. Stop You're in wet trouble. Blanket. We got in, so we have to take advantage. I need to use the bathroom. Can you come with me? I don't know where the bathrooms are, and I think I'm going to get lost. You're old enough. This place doesn't seem that big. You can go by yourself. Of course, it ain't big. Only, only just this area you're in. Besides, only the map layout shows of how big the place is. Then. Well, everything went silent for some reason without music or anything. Everything is brand new. Hmm. <laughs> Something is gonna happen. Very, very bad. I hear music. Diego, aren't you supposed to be turning on the games? What are you doing here? That's not your friend. Someone else. <laughs> I know you're in here. <laughs> Wait, what is that? Found you! That's William. But his voice sounds different. Like, did he make a voice different? Hey I don't know. Come out wherever you are. I'm sorry, Diego. Ben! Uh-oh. Wait. Is this teaser a most like, of course? This teaser it shows the together. beginning of the missing children now. About those children who become the weather animatronics. And shows the beginning for our new character Jeremy's job. He's coming. Ever since I signed, I felt like something was controlling me. I watched you die. The music sounds really good. He ignored me. <laughs> ignored me. Well, thank you for the opportunity, man. Show yourself. Whoa, wait, what? Local story coming to Owen tell the meaning thing. I can personally assure you that whatever is going on out there, however tragic it may be, has nothing to do with our establishment. What? What? What the? Ha! Ha! What? What just? Okay, first thing I noticed what just changed. That we are in the parts and service room with those area animatronics. But what? William? His arms are mostly bleeding out. I don't know, it could be some sort of nightmare or vision that William's having, or he's actually his bleeding eyes or something. Like, doing like the same thing as Michael getting shot. Back in Halloween 2, the original, like something like that, but um, it's mostly different. Like, of course, we all know it might happen very soon to the third movie that he's mostly immortal, becoming a spring child since he's alive for some reason. So, even some of those parts of there is like a robber getting killed. Forcefully, <laughs> and there's some art locations like place at a school or something, even with some sort of random teacher fall to some sort of pipe or something to the chest. Um, yeah, because this movie is going to be something else than the first one, and uh, seeing the one that is mostly with William and the, this other character up in the roof of the building. Well, doing something similar like the first movie because there's one simple new different random night guard who's trying to tell uh, Mike to get out of here before it's too late. But he didn't manage to escape in time since he mostly uh getting killed by falling while trying to run out to the roof. It's something similar like that, but it's mostly raining out something epic. And I see something that this character on the left holding something is probably a knife or something. Something to kill off William. But we uh, know this is mostly a prequel. 
Watch out, it's only called two. But it's mostly prequel, and we know how this all ends with a prequel that leads to the first movie and a sequel. That a villain wins again. Well, only wins for the prequel or whatnot. But who knows? We don't know how the story is going to be. It's something epic. Besides, months or weeks ago, when I noticed about the April Fool's thing, when uh, that fake movie released, it shows the hour, if it might be true, that it's mostly a two hour. Does that mean this movie is going to be a two hour film? Is that true? Or the director made something different or it is actually going to be a two-hour film because in April Fool's it does show it. Maybe I'm just not seeing it. I don't know if it is a one hour but who knows this film is going to be amazing. Well that was a very awesome video Dark Fates Productions. You guys did amazing. So yeah and I'm glad if I truly want to say this so Sometimes these other people are getting themselves voice acted in this film. Besides, I get to voice in this film as well. If I'm fine of saying that right now in this video. Besides, even myself in this movie, making something good for this making good for this film. Besides, I don't know what will going to be, or even the third movie. Anyways, folks. Hope you enjoyed this reaction video since I released it on first day. Because I want to do this is support these guys who did amazing in making this movie, even this teaser trailer. And I can't wait it I can't wait for it to release. <sighs> Anyways folks, hope you enjoyed this. And mostly today is my sister's birthday, so I'm going to celebrate her birthday right now. Till before the night comes. And mostly my sister. Her mostly, she's mostly a YouTuber, goes by the name Sophia Flowerfield. The link to her channel is down below in the description. So support her and give her so many comments about a happy birthday. So, yeah folks. This is mostly a good day right now. This is Lord of Flames here. I'll see you guys next time. Bye folks. Have a wonderful day.